If I had the Shadow 2, I would bring that out, but I don't have the Shadow 2. I will one day. That part, I guarantee I will have one day. Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. I never said I was just thinking about getting it. I didn't say that maybe one day I will have a CZ Shadow 2. I guaranteed you that I would have a Shadow 2. And here it is. I picked this up locally in a trade, a great deal all around. It is like new condition. The previous owner said he, he barely did any, anything with it. Loved the gun, but he, he just said, you know what, it's time to move on. And I said, it is time to move on. I need the Shadow 2. And here it is. It's called the black and blue model because of the blue aluminum grips. It has a cool look to it. Very well regarded handgun. A lot of people love the Shadow 2. I don't know that I ever heard anything negative about it. It's a great handgun. Very refined. Very elegant. Very expensive. MSRP $13.59. Right around $12.50 will get you this. That remained fairly consistent throughout the years. But the trigger and the action and the weight makes it a great com competition handgun. A lot of people are competing with this. Now prior to this, the CZ SP-01 was the 9mm Darling in the CZ line of pistols. And this is a great handgun. 4.6 inch barrel. This has a 4.9 inch barrel. But I've enjoyed this. But this is the, the premier. They have the TS-9 model. That's, that's awesome too. That's a lot more expensive. This is going to do it for me. Now I've shot the Shadow 2 on several occasions. I believe three separate times and I just loved it. I said this is a great handgun. Aluminum grips, okay, look great. In the trade deal, it included some black grips, which are okay, and then some G10 grips, a little too pinkish for me. Kind of cool, just not my flavor. I'm sticking with the aluminum grips. 17 round mags, the 19 round mag with the SP-01 will work just fine. CZ-75s are very much interchangeable. And ambidextrous thumb safety. All right, so you do have an ambidextrous thumb safety. And they also give you another one in the case, in case you want the, the flush fitting thumb safety. See how that sticks out a little bit? This side is flush, but if you want both sides like this, they offer that, just switch them out. And then here we have an unloaded firearm. Single action trigger pull. I'm measuring right at three and a quarter pounds with the reset. Really nice, really short. Does have an accessory rail right there. A beefed up dust cover. That reduces the muzzle rise when shooting. Front serrations. Serrated black rear sights that are adjustable. CZ calls them Hajo, H-A-J-O, whatever that means. I tried looking it up. There's no information on what that means. I believe it has to do with the adjustments that you can make on them on this you can pick it up for like 90 bucks on the cz store fiber optic front sight three point or i'm sorry four point nine inch barrel double action trigger pull is pretty incredible all steel handgun now i know some people who watch this channel may say did you trade your Beretta 92X performance for that. No way. No way. I've often called this my favorite handgun. And we'll see if the Shadow 2 overtakes that in, in my eyes. I'm going to do a comparison. I'm going to shoot them side by side. These are two premier 9mm handguns. And I'm, I'm fond of both of them. But the CZ Shadow 2 is a, a beautiful handgun. Now... The magazine release, you can see sticks out a little bit. That is adjustable. You can sink it in a little deeper, make it come out. It's got a, a nice position on it right now. Extended beaver tail, undercut in the trigger guard. The mag release is reversible, by the way. And a fine handgun all around. Let's go ahead and get it on the scale, and we will take a look at this and the... 92x performance the unloaded weight you're looking at two pounds 14 and what's that seven eighths ounces and with just ounces 46 and three quarters so it's definitely yeah some weight uh 17 rounds right here 
53 and 7 8 ounces. Now just for fun, let's put this 92X Performance, 55 and 3 quarters. So approximately a little under 2 ounces heavier with the 92X Performance. But that's okay. Let's throw the SPO one while we have it out here. 48 and an eighth. So the CZ Shadow 2 definitely has some weight behind it. A lot of people appreciate that. I sure I love all steel guns. All steel guns are amazing, and this one just fits the bill. Ergonomically, it is excellent. And that double action trigger pull is really nice. I've often raved about the double action trigger pull on the 92x performance and they they both feel great between i would say between seven and eight pounds on each all right but it's a good looking gun it's an eloquent gun it's a fine shooting handgun it's a heavy pistol but it certainly gets the job done i cannot wait to show this off more and i think people who have this they appreciate it they love it and they do for they do so with good reason and this is the cz shadow 2 in my possession finally and i hope to show this off quite a bit if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe